Schools are out and kids are ready to have a little summer fun. Unfortunately, this time of the year can also be a very busy time for hospital emergency rooms. Now the Connecticut Children's Medical Center is teaming up with the state police, the Red Cross, and other organizations to get the word out about staying safe. News 8's Kim Pierce has details. How do you make sure your child doesn't end up here? The experts say you have to use that parental superpower, supervision. I think we all need to use our supervision uh, and the powers that we have with our supervision to keep kids safe. Supervise the kids anytime they're around water, pools, rivers, lakes, anything. And if the family goes boating, make sure they wear a life jacket. A good fitting life jacket. You shouldn't have an adult jacket on a child or a PFD, a personal flotation device. You shouldn't have a child one on an adult. And it's only adults who should handle fireworks. Most fireworks are illegal in Connecticut for a reason, and even the legal ones burn very hot. Even something as simple as a sparkler that I think many of us have enjoyed in the past can cause serious injury. In fact, up to 17% of firework injuries are related to sparklers. Summer dangers don't end just because the kids get a little bit older. Teenagers can go swimming in the wrong place. They can get involved with underage drinking. Worst of all, that drinking could then lead to them getting behind the wheel when they shouldn't. State Police Spokesman Lieutenant Paul Vance says those decisions can be life-changing. And by life-changing, I'm not just talking about court appearances. I'm not just talking the consequences of losing or injuring a close, good friend. I'm talking about the potential of ending up incarcerated which could be even worse than ending up here in the hospital. In Hartford, I'm Kent Pierce, News 8.